how to change an Infiniti 2013 G37X front brake pads. Brake pads. Oh, this person will tell you if you pairs. <laughs> what? Give them a nice kick. Pop her on on. Watch that fluid shit. You know? yeah. We can't swear on YouTube. Why is it on YouTube? It's gonna be. So then you get this little mutt back here off first. Yeah. Yeah. What size are you using? I'll tell you in a minute. Oh, and it came off nine. Uh, 916. 916s. 916. It's the only bolt you need. That and your lug nuts. And then one on the bottom. Okay. On the bottom, right underneath. Yep. Comes off nice and easy. Nice for and them. easy, nice and easy. You want to make sure when you're compressing that your oil, brake pad, your, blue, your brake fluid doesn't come out. That. Yeah. Brake fluid don't come out. No. After you get those nuts off, you're gonna do this. Now I gotta compress these things. It's a little dirty in there. Yeah, no big deal. These ones were just as bad. Bad. You don't want your brakes to look like that. Watch that fluid now. Okay. Yeah, it's going up. Is it coming? Tell it's me when gonna, it gets up to the top. Coming. Okay, hold on. Yeah, you don't want that to overflow. Okay, then I got this here brake fluid where I'm going to take this extra brake fluid out and squirt it into here because then then you got like, you know, brake fluid when you need it. Then it doesn't get all over your car. Yeah. And make a mess. Okay, so you tell me when they come up again, if I gotta do this again, okay? All right? Okay. He's just... Squeezing the drums. Make sure that fluid doesn't come over. It's getting high again. Is it? Getting Not high yet. High? Not coming over yet. Huh? Not over the top yet. Turn some light on over here. Check out your brake fluid stuff. Make sure you don't got none. Mm -hmm. Not coming out. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Once you squeeze these down to the bottom. Is that fluid still good? Mm -mm. Does it need to come squirting? Do I gotta get it? Not yet? Yeah. 
It's Lee Kane. Okay. Look out. Okay. There's that. Now I'm just gonna squeeze this down all the way and then that's done. Then I put your brake pads on again. Huh? Brake pads. Oh. Here's one going on like this. See, this will be going like this. This piece goes on the top with this thing here. Okay. Oh, I took the back one off already. Now I take this clip out and I put another one on. Okay, that's on. And this one. Hold on, I want to use that grease on this shit here, hey? Okay. I think, right? Okay. Yeah, I want to put it down here and right here. Oof. Break grease. Yeah. Okay. And break grease, hmm? Huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Just put some brake grease wherever you said to put brake grease. So we're just going to put a little bit here, a little bit in here, a little bit here, a little bit here. I don't know, wherever you want. Pretty much. Yeah. And with the other side as well, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which is right here. Mm -hmm. Some brake grease. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I never used it before, but there's always a start for everybody. Mm -hmm. Today's the day. Yeah. You just put it on the back side to keep it from like making a bunch of noise, I guess. I don't understand it, but that's what they say. Now that I got my hands all covered in grease, that's cool. Then you get that in there. Let me try to get it in there real quick. That is greasy. Yeah, I shouldn't have put so much grease on, I guess. Now it's all over my hands and shit. <laughs> you can't swear for you to. Let me see your phone. Put your oh. phone over here or something so I can see where this thing is. I can't get it to go in there. 
I'm gonna have to get my own way. Why don't you shut your YouTube thing off for a minute? <laughs> I can't, I have to finish it. <laughs> Tricky, but yeah, it just didn't work. Then this goes on. Push these little things so you can get your caliper back on. Okay. Push what? These little pieces of rubber <laughs> right here. Oh, okay. This will come out, and then you can't get it on. But if you, you know, okay, put this bolt in here, the one on the bottom, and that's it. Sweet. Okay. And then it's all done? Well, as soon as I tighten it. Then we then we pump your brakes a little and put the amount of fluid you need in and then it'll be done. Okay. We we let your car down and we pump the brakes a little bit. Just so uh if you had to air or air um get the air out of your brake line, mm -hmm. you'd have to unscrew right here on this thing. I think, yeah. Right here is your bleeder for your brakes. Okay. You would unscrew that to get air out of your lines, but you don't have any air in the lines because I didn't let there any air going in. Okay. Okay, it's easy enough. It's all easy enough. <laughs> Tighten them things up. Tighten them up and down. You don't have to have them super ass tight, just like you know, hand tight. Well, a little like like maybe a one one turn of tightness. About that tight, right there. Okay. Okay. Then that'll tighten up when your brakes come on. Okay. Yep. That's it. In a nutshell. Huh? Then put your tire back on, guys. Tire on. Let me wipe my hands a little bit. Okay. Is that it then? Yeah, I think that's it. That's it. Oh yeah, your brake fluid shit. You got to do that too. You pour the remainder of that stuff in there. So you're not down at all. Okay. That what you need anyway. So it's full. Then you put your cap on. Then you pump your brakes. Okay. Then you pump your brakes. That way, uh that way you won't you'll start your engine, you'll pump your brake, and then it'll add more fluid. Okay. The man has so how he Thank you very much. <laughs> what a dope.